Well, here we go. I got home yesterday, last night actually, and the mileage is now 335943, and I started at 3267 uh, something. So that's about 9,000 miles in a month. And got home, nope. Here. No leaks, no drips, no fuss, no nothing. Coated in bugs. But guys, yeah. Can't say I didn't have a little trepidation about taking this long of a trip in an old car, but I'm telling you, <laughs> early on, as you know, in my other video, I had a Code 13, which is elect ignition electrical stuff, and there was some other like little symptoms going on. So on the road, I think out in Pennsylvania or North Carolina somewhere, I did change out the distributor. And that seemed to take care of that. And then on the last leg of the trip, I was getting a code 25, which is lean condition, which explains the, my drop in fuel economy from 18, 19 down to 15. Um, so there's something to be sorted out there too, but that's it. Other than that, everything's been flawless. Everything on this rig. No problems at all. And, uh, you know, here's the thing, right? Here's the thing. On the internet, people complain and complain about the 3VZE, the, the 3.0 Toyota. And this is an amazing engine. And it went across country 9,000 miles in a, less than, a little bit less than a month. Mountains, valleys, deserts, all the way to, from the Pacific coast to the Atlantic coast and back went out to Chicago out to towards Pennsylvania into Pennsylvania then wound down south all the way down to Key Largo Florida and the Everglades back up through Tennessee and across and a lot of side trips during that whole thing and she did great you saw the mileage 32 years old so all y'all complaining about the 3.0, you're wrong. <laughs> you're wrong. I just proved it. I don't know if it's proof, but yeah. What other car are you going to take that's 32 years old, that the rear ends, the front end, the differentials have never been rebuilt? The transfer case, the transmission, the engine has never been rebuilt. All original, and you're going to take it on a road trip around the whole country and have it come back and not be a problem. Tell me, really, <laughs> tell me, uh, BMW, 32 year old BMW, nope, pretty much 32 year old anything General Motors, nope, um, possibly an old 32 year old Ford, maybe a Crown Victoria or a old diesel pickup, probably a Dodge Cummins diesel pickup maybe, anything else Chrysler, nope, um, Maybe an old Honda, but would you do it in an old Toyota Camry, Corolla, Land Cruiser, Forerunner, pickup? I would be all right with that, but as you know, the key is, is maintenance, so taking care of this stuff and not beating on it or whatever, you know? If you're extreme duty use where you're idling at a mile an hour for hours, in a hundred degree heat rock crawling or you're flogging it and mud bogging it or jumping it that kind of stuff yeah it's gonna break but the the 3.0 hait is unwarranted and I did it with a little more horsepower and a little more torque than a 22R not hating on the 22R it's one of my favorite Toyota engines um, but yeah the 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 complaints about the 3.0 I just keep showing you. It's all I can do. It's all I can do. There's still thousands of those things running around with owners that have no idea that their car is supposed to be bad, you know? They don't have any idea and they're all running fine. So it's, <clears throat> every engine has a weak spot. Um, 
Admittedly, the 3.4 solved some of the things. It was a good, good, solid upgrade. And yeah, so I'm not gonna argue about that one either, but yep. And anyway, <laughs> it, it did it. I'm gonna do some more videos on stuff. She needs to be gone through. Um, if I find out what that code 25 is about, maybe I'll make a video on that. I didn't do a whole lot of videos on the trips. This was about dad and daughter time, that kind of stuff. And I haven't gotten into trip vlogging and all that kind of stuff, maybe one of these days. Um, but I tried that before and those videos got a lot less views. However, the technical videos I do get a lot of views, but very few subscribers because it's just people looking for info and then they go do the thing and forget it you know so it's not a channel builder anyway getting off topic so all right we'll do some more here and we have some projects to do on that so if you guys are interested in that an old ford idi and that's my neighbor's idiot dogs always interrupting videos do you know how many i've erased because of the neighbor's dogs <laughs> so all right anyway i'm out and i appreciate all you guys yep thanks for watching and thanks for sticking around those of you that watch regularly especially i appreciate y'all so all right see ya